Hi everyone, my name is Jeffrey Bardzell. I'm the program director of the HCID program at Indiana University, and I'd like to tell you about the program today. The program is designed to be an experience. Um, that is something we've actually tried to craft from the very beginning. And that, that not only means things like courses that are interlocking in the sense that they, they try to build on complementary strengths and sort of cohere, but we also work very hard to create what we call a cohort culture. Um, and what that means is we're really interested in students who, not competing with each other, but collaborating with each other. At IU, we believe that uh, if any one of us is successful, it actually helps all the rest of us be successful. So a big part of this program is actually collaboration, is working together uh, in pursuit of something that's bigger than any one person. We believe that design should be used for good. Uh, at the end of the day, what we really believe that we should be doing as developers of technology, designers of technology, is we should be trying to understand people's needs. It's not superficial needs or not cosmetic needs or not demand that we create in order to satisfy, but what do people actually need in order to thrive, uh, in order to, to do better work, in order to be closer to other people, in order to be better citizens in society, uh, in order to be more inclusive or more just. And then the question is, how can those values be enacted through the professional practice of HCI and design? And so we do research to try to gain insight into questions like that. And we, when we design and evaluate products and product concepts, we not only think about the bottom line or profitability or whether something can technically be built or whether it will work, but we ask a much deeper question, does anybody really need this? The faculty you, you will be working with are actually seen as leaders in the research field. We're pushing uh, the, the, uh, the field forward. We are on the cutting edge of HCI research. Um, and some of the work that we have become internationally recognized for is our work on design thinking, sustainable HCI, feminist HCI, and uh, social justice, political economies of HCI. So we really have a very diverse set of, uh, of, of, of research agendas, but I think what's common to them is a, a strong emphasis on design, design theory, a strong emphasis on social value and social values and social justice. Um, and so those are some of the things that hold us together and you can expect to see those values sort of sewn through uh, our curriculum, which nonetheless remains very industry focused and practical. The good news about jobs is everybody gets a job, truly. Our, our, our placement rates are, are virtually 100% uh, for every cohort. Uh, these jobs are hot, they're in high demand. This program prepares students to get their first jobs, um, and people do. And, uh, but what I also want to say is one of the benefits of a Master of Science program is that it's not just about getting your first job, it's about getting your second job and your third job and your fifth job. And so we'll not only prepare you to get your first job in, in less than two years after you enter the program, but also uh, in, in thriving in your profession and accelerating through your career and having a very fast trajectory up into those more influential and higher paying and more exciting positions. Because this program has been around for uh, almost 20 years, we have nearly a thousand alumni. And those alumni are very strongly engaged in the program. And this is actually an outcome of the cohort culture, that we believe that the cohort culture is not only about being uh, in HCI when you're here, once you get a degree from HCID, you have that degree for life. And we want you to be part of our community for life. And that has been the case. So we have hundreds of alumni who regularly engage in our program. They mentor our students one-on-one. -on -one. They will critique portfolios. They will serve as a professional network to help make introductions and help you get jobs. Whether you're from computer science or literature or uh, accounting or industrial design, all of those kinds of people fit in our program. But what we're really looking for is collaborators. We're looking for creative people, people who are willing to push themselves, people who are willing to go a little bit into, the, into a space where they're uncomfortable, people who are willing to take a risk, people who are willing to fail and learn from that failure, people who are willing to work with other people and who want the people that they work with not to agree with them, but to surprise them. I genuinely believe that this is one of, if not the best, HCI programs in the country. The reason why is because we've been at this for a very long time. The curriculum works. The faculty work well together. The cohort culture works. We get people jobs. I know from alumni who've been out of the program for 10, 15 years, they still come back and they say, hey, this program prepared me really well for my career, 
even today, I'm still using what I learned in the program. Um, so we produce the short-term outcomes, the long-term outcomes, and while you're here, you will have a thoroughly engaging uh, and exciting experience. Yes, it will be challenging, at times it will be stressful, but above all, it will be an, an engaging and exciting moment where your life will be transformed uh, in a way that will make you into a designer who is capable and effective, but also guided and driven by values and real needs. Thank you very much for watching and please reach out if you have any questions.